What is up everybody, this is Just Muang, and we are here with Teppin. Obviously, it's the gung-ho mobile game that um, uses Capcom IP characters. I really like this game, it's very fast-paced. And we're gonna go dive in with some Ryu, you know. Ryu, uh, the red decks, I'm right here using the Metsu Shoryuken. This is my deck right now that I'm using. It has a mix of red and green, so the point of it is to kind of like buff your monster ups, right? Buff your monster up to the 12 AP and use the hero art for Metsu Shoryuken where I can combo. Um, and when combo is stacked, you can do two hit combo so your characters can attack twice. So we're gonna go into the matches, check it out, and show you what it's about, man, all right? So stay tuned. All right, so Ryu versus Chung Li right now. Um, my MP max is gonna be five, so that's gonna be pretty interesting. Yeah, I'm gonna summon Queen Beast of 5, so now she already has flight. So that thing with the wings, so if that flight, it means that I attack directly and I don't attack the monsters. So I'm gonna buff up. So even though uh, you have Queen Bee versus uh, Chun Li's green card in the same position, it's not gonna attack her. It's going to attack Chun Li directly, right? So right now, I'm gonna buff her six times, right? So six attack, and my AP is 8 to 12, if you see the bottom left. Once I hit 12, I can do the super art. Boom, 6 damage right there, right? So now when she attacks me, that card is going to attack directly to that monster itself. Right? It's not going to attack me. So then, that her monster is going to die instantly. So look, I'm doing plus 2, minus 2 right there. So I'm buffing my characters up. So I can get just more damage in general. So now I'm 8-3, right? So boom, look. She takes 8 attack, she added a shield, I'm gonna add that card to give me some more defense. Metro Shoryuken, now it's the combo, and look, look how much damage I am about to hit her. Boom! 8, and that Hugo card is so cheap, I'm telling you, because that card lets me attack right away. It's a quick attack. You obviously know from Pokemon that quick attacks it hits instantly, and look at this. This is just GG at this point. I'm going to just give her a shield just in case if some like, bullshit happens, but other than that, it's, this is game. Like, he's... He's already lost. Like, like yeah, I already buffed now, now nine attack, so I'm gonna do 18 damage to Chun Li, who only has eight attack. So you already know what's about to go down. This is the game over, right? These these situations. Look at that easy rush down, Ryu. Oh, <laughs> all right. We got num match number two going on. It's gonna be against Raffalos, and Raffalos using Raffle Woken. It's pretty good. Um, the more pretty much. The more buffs that that monster gets, the more pretty much attack and flight that he will buff himself. So it's kind of like the same, 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 same similar situation with Metro Shoryuken, but Metro Shoryuken just gives me that combo, right? I use that one card to sacrifice with the, with the Dan. Uh, gives me two and then takes away defense minus two, but since that monster is like already hitting like like one damage versus and it has eight defense, I can afford stuff like that, right? I'm gonna add Guy there. Guy does a quick attack right away. He has the rush, so he can only do that one single time. All right, he's gonna give plus one to friendly unit, units. All right, he's gonna try to kill my Rafflos because I buffed it, right? So I'm like, all right, that's cool. I'm gonna sacrifice Rafflos and I'm gonna give my power ups to Guy because he already has five defense, right? So boom, that's four. That's fine. Look, I hit him for four attack right away, and now that's gonna trade. And yeah, he's gonna kill my monster. He's gonna have two. I'm gonna add flight. Uh, and a plus two only for this round, but the flight stays permanently, which is really good because I want to go over these attacks. I don't want to attack them directly. And I'm going to do the Metsu Shoryuken right away. Look at this. This is just pure, like, aggressive rushdown reactive. It's not turn-based. You can just attack right away if you can, if you have the MP to just attack, right? Boom, I'm going to add another six. If he can't defend right now, if he, if he's not, if he can't protect his life points right there, this is game over right now. He doesn't have close to AP to 917. Because, yeah, whatever. I'm going to take that. I'm gonna take that two damage. That's fine. And you know what? You're gonna buff your character. I'm gonna add my shield. So now my shield is instant, right? Now I'm gonna that damage that you're about to do a guy for that three damage. It's oh, it's gonna do nothing to me. And I'm gonna do the quick attack. So I'm gonna attack right away. So we're both gonna attack the same time, but my guy is just more buff. It's gonna be more stronger than you. And this is going to. B pa pow look at that 12 damage because of that flight too strong oh no the dragon fell down and ryu man like i said if you guys trying to copy my deck just watch that watch the from the go back in the beginning of the video and copy that all right so now we're gonna try rathalos out and you know he's another aggressive character and i like to use the rafa woken hero art 
uh, just because it, it's gonna be buffing up my the, you know the, the monster I choose so look this is the deck I'm using it's gonna be sim very similar to the Ryu one but like we're gonna have some just different monsters like the neon tiger we're gonna have the leader summons the metal c15s but in terms of having the same like cards to help buff my characters like suicidal charge true faith um, Beast Cannon, Reckless Charge, Wall Jump, it's still going to be very similar. So, yeah, let's 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 try this deck out online, man. Alright, so Raffalo versus Dante. And uh, he has Quicksilver, is going to put me in slow, but my, hopefully my Raffle Woken can, can get there in time. I have 17 AP. Dante has 27, which is pretty hard. So, Leader Summons, pretty good card. It pretty much puts a Jaggy in all boards. I just kind of want to just deal some damage in the first place, you know what I mean? Let me just put stuff on the field, right? Gives, and then like, like an uh, angry charge uh, is gonna give me plus two attack for, the, for the character. So we're not gonna use that yet. We're just gonna just let this play out for a little bit. You know, attack, attack. I see now he has two cards, and I wanna probably. Oh, okay. He's gonna draw a card. That's a really good card, right? Because it forces like this this resonates uh, situation. And he wants to just buff the characters because Dante is all about buffing. So I'm going to add plus two for uh, for my character right here. Right, so we're going to give Jaggy a 4-2 real quick. Because why not? Might as well spend it because it's pretty much free MP at this point, right? We're going to add the Neon Tiger. Throw him right here for 1-10. to 10. And uh, let's... Uh... Oh, what's, what's this? What's this card? Okay, change his attack to enemy with 3 or higher attack to minus 1, that's fine. I'm going to give him Beast Cannon so I can kill uh, this character in the bottom right here on the left. Because he has 4 three. Oh, 4 3, nice with the halt. Oh, that's good. But yeah, let's, let's buff it again. So then now we have 4 to 8. i got to buff my Neon Tiger up because we're very close to, to getting that Wrath Awoken, you feel me? And when you put me in halt, it's not I'm not gonna be able to attack. I actually have to wait for the timer to go down. This actually doesn't even trade damages, which is actually pretty cheap, I would say. That's actually very, very hard to deal with. Now I gotta put another neon tiger because that card probably is gonna get washed. So you see how I was like very hesitant to do that. I was very, very hesitant to attack him at this point. So yeah, we're gonna add this one card, true faith. So now we're gonna add plus two, three to ten, so I could kill that card when I get to him. Right, so I'm probably going to focus on trying to buff up this Neon Tiger. That's fine. Good. Good. I love when people do that because then I'm able to, to just stack more. Let me see. Now I got five, ta five attack, five damage. Boom. Let's go. Five damage right here. See you later, like, with eyeball. Right, and I'm going to give him the Raffle Woken. So I'm going to be in the flight as well now. And I got the buff. So we got 10 damage right here. So now he has to try to somehow defend against this 10 damage with flight which is going to be hard oh it puts me on halt that's good stuff and so i'm probably gonna use iris yep gonna hold it there and boom iris gonna make my mp go a lot faster right okay so now so now i'm in halt right now and he's probably gonna try to kill this character inflicts halt for an enemy that costs five mp or more for five seconds that's fine because she's just there just to give me that speed so i'm gonna give this attack right away because just in case he tries to kill the character or puts me in more hall, I want to just kind of like get the life lead, put, in, put in a situation. <sighs> Ooh, you're gonna put me through EX? I was smart stuff. Oh my god, look at that! My uh, my rushdown just got lost. Oh my god! So now I'm gonna put Neon Tiger again and start over, which is kind of sad, I would say. You know, I'm gonna throw some cards out in this field. Get some shield cards right here, man. But this is looking kind of kind of bad all right so we're gonna throw some more cards out probably throw another iris like i said i need to get this life i need to get this mp and i can't really do too much right now right because all, all i have are just just hero cards instead and i'm gonna put this add the flight in there okay now i got the beast cannon that's gonna buff this character up so let's do that three to five that's fine right and then he's in flight, so I can attack directly. Ooh. Okay, I'm gonna add shield, so I'm gonna subtract the damage that I'm gonna be taking from the minus two. That's fine. I will take that. That's okay. And I'm gonna have the suicidal charge up there for Iris, because I just wanna have some damage in the pocket. And you know, he is trying to buff up the Dante, which is kinda hard, but I got the Hugo prep. I just need to buff up my characters just a little bit. Let me buff up my characters a little bit, so I can just, you know, 
try to get this win. This is this is gonna be pretty hard. All right, I'm gonna probably do that. Oh Still my god, he, he he did a first. He's gonna put me in slow. Look how slow I am, but that's fine. I'm going to do all this. Add my my buff up to ten. That's fine. Oh my god, so I'm gonna have to shield right here. So I'm gonna do ten right here. Oh my god, I'm so scared. And then I want to add the flight. Look at that. I add the flight so Dante can attack him. And so I could just take the damage right there. That was so good. That was so close. And shout outs to my reactions on that one. That My reactions were pretty intense right there. That's fine. I don't mind. Look at this. Now you, you messed up because you did that and you gave me a free turn to use another action card. I have plus 12. Okay, that's fine. I have 11 now. And guess, look Look at that Hugo. Look at that Hugo on my fourth card slot. He's waiting to be used. One cost. And it's going to get that. And I'm going to kill you. Because I'm going to do this. If you can't send this card back, it is game over. What do you have? The time is clicking. Oh, you pressed the wrong button for sure. You actually couldn't send that. because You actually... Couldn't send that because that was a four. Peace out. Oh, let's go. Look at that comeback. All right, so we're gonna run back one more. And this guy is a five. Wow, okay. So let's try another Raffalos. Usually, I do like uh, when I want to practice, I practice a lot of the decks under free match. But other than that, I'm just gonna put this Iris here, you know, get my MP up faster. And she has shield plus six. Six defense, which is pretty strong. And yeah, Neon Tiger is three. And he has ten, so I can do a lot of cool stuff. Okay, he's gonna buff up his Chris. That's fine. I'm gonna do shield charge. Let's get that charge plus two. And then he's gonna keep buffing. That's fine. Yeah, keep buffing your Chris. Yep, I know you wanna do heavy pierce uh, for Chris. But I can do similar situations. So he's probably gonna kill Iris right here, like in one hit. But I'm gonna keep buffing up um, Neon Tiger right here. So I'm gonna have 5 to 10. And I'm 2 AP away from getting Wrath of Wolf. So, okay, get 5 HP. So he's gonna have 6 11. That's fine. I mean, I have no problem just. Oh, this is gonna hurt actually. This is gonna hurt, but that's fine. I'll just take the damage right here. Yep, that's fine. But I'm going to get myself Flight real quick. Oh, I'm going to add a Neon Tiger right here. Might as well. Because I have Flight from Wrath of Woken. Because I don't want to take another set of damage. Right. So we're going to buff this character up. So now he's at 7. Boom. Um, let's see. Now I have another card to do this. So I'm going to give him 9 attack. Right. Even though I already have Flight, I just want to get that good 9 attack right away. He's gonna buff up uh, Karen. Okay, he wants to get two cards in there. That's fine. Uh, I should put shield so I can take a hit so I don't have to take the piercing damage for another seven damage. So, because I want to stall, right? I want to get as much damage off before he gets the party started with Karen. Yep, look at that. Took the defense right there. That's gonna do piercing. And yeah, okay, he's gonna heal. More healing, but I'm gonna buff my character Neon Tiger for 11. Right, oh man, what if I what if I just draw Hugo right there? That would be just game over. Eleven. I'm gonna have the shield character right here. Look at I am laming him out. Right here. See like this is pretty much game. What are you gonna do now? Oh you're gonna do give more three HP to all friendly allies. You know what? Why not? Oh and I got the Hugo. Oh no. Cause you already know what's about to happen. I'm already attacking so let me just do Hugo anyway. Oh, and I threw another Hugo. Yeah, green cards usually can't stop the situation right here. And that was the red decks from Teppin for Ryu and Raffalos. Hope you enjoyed. Please like, share, subscribe. Let me know if you guys are enjoying the game. And tell me, you know, what kind of decks I should be using or trying out and all that good stuff. And other than that, I will see you guys later. Peace. 
All right, everybody, just wanted to show you guys real quick about my new collection, the Jay Wong brand shirt. So we got this one, the Jay Wong Clutch Out. We got other shirts as well. I just want to just throw it out there. You know, it really helps a lot if you guys can really support, buy a shirt, you know, you know, share it to your friends, buy a hoodie, hat, beanie. It will really mean a lot and it will help me as a player, as an influencer, just as somebody that you look up to, it will really help me just to keep moving things you know what i mean keep progressing in life and keep giving you the content that you guys deserve link is in the description and once again please if you're interested check it out man it's just wong i'll see you guys later peace